only doing YouTube for the money. Okay. You have beef with another YouTuber. The truth is, yes, I do have beef with another YouTuber. You got me pregnant. We have some really important news to share with you guys. Yo, what are you saying, boys and girls? I have got a banger for you today. Now, ever since I started doing the Real Morgs content that you all love, there has been one video idea that you've been begging me to do, and I have been absolutely bricking it. I did not want to do it. And today, I'm finally doing it. Answering your assumptions about me. However, of course, there's a twist. To make sure I don't the out event. Can I say that? Can I say that out? To make sure I don't wimp out of answering any questions, for every question that I refuse to answer, I have to give away £100 to one of you. So yeah, make sure you guys watch till the end if you want to see me get absolutely humiliated and possibly win some money. Let's go. You're still a virgin. Right, are you a virgin? Brilliant. What a, what a great start to the bloody video. You know what, I thought first question, Tamsin was gonna, you know, go easy on me, kind of get, get settled into the video. No, straight out, first question. We're starting with that. Right, it's time for the question. You all wanna know. The answer is yes. I'm just an innocent child of the Lord. I'm waiting until marriage. I have never actually even touched a female in my life. The closest I ever did was I actually held hands with a female once. And that's about the most I've done, guys. So, you know, I'm getting there. I'm getting there, guys. You know, it's baby steps, baby steps. You are actually five foot nine. You know what, ladies and gentlemen, I have gotten this question so much. How tall actually are you? For some reason, everybody seems to think I'm a bloody midget. The truth is, no, I'm actually a big lanky dosser, six foot four. And if you don't believe me, I'm gonna go and prove it. Right, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for the truth to be revealed. As you can see, I've got the tape measure. What are we measuring? Oh yeah, and I've also got mum here. Are we ready? The big reveal. 76 inches, that is six foot four! Hey! Yay! Yes! Let's go! I'm actually a giant! You're a big lanky boy! Wait, what? You're a big lanky boy! You can't handle your drink, so you got thrown out of O Beach. Oh no! I was really hoping nobody saw. Okay, right, I think we need to explain. So the assumption is you can't handle your drink. Drink meaning a certain type of drink. I'm not talking about Diet Coke, because I can certainly handle those. And you would definitely be correct. I can't. And the second part of the message, he is referring to a few weeks ago when I was on holiday in Ibiza. I was with Tamsin and a few other YouTubers at a nice ocean club and drank a lot too much and ended up getting chucked out. I think I managed to just about hobble out. It wasn't pretty, let's just say that. Tamsin's bad at me. I got too f***ed apparently. Let's go, boys. You have beef with another YouTuber. Ooh, okay, okay. I, I see where this is going. We're starting to go towards the, the drama route. Beef with another YouTuber. Do I or don't I? The truth is, yes, I do have beef with another YouTuber. And that YouTuber is... <sighs> more mum. Because she cooked me chicken today and she didn't put sauce on it. And it was really plain. So, yeah. She's a dosser. You're adopted. Oh my God. Okay, well, you know what? Talking about Morg's mom, you're adopted. I guess there's only one way to find out, guys. I'm, I'm, I think we're gonna have to go confront her about this. This is a... Ah! Morgan, can you just stop doing that, please? What's the matter? I've got a question for you, mom. Why are you filming? Because this is serious. This is the question that the people want me to ask. This is the question that everyone wants to know. Okay, go on, what is it? Am I adopted? Yes. We've covered this loads of times in videos. Wait, what? You're adopted. Why, what? You're adopted. What do you want me to say? You were wanted. Did you know you earned loads of money? Is this some sort of bloody joke? No, what? Is this a joke? You don't even look like me. 
Yeah, I, I did wonder why I was so much better looking. Are you actually being serious? Morgan, of course I'm not being serious. Oh, it's a general. Yeah. You actually enjoyed playing the over-exaggerated morgues. Okay, this is kind of an interesting one. I know there'll be some of you that are actually interested about this. And the truth is, guys, it was a weird thing because I don't think I actually, I wouldn't say I enjoyed being, you know, the crazy, yo guys, it's Morgs. Today we're gonna be doing $10,000 backflip challenge. Oh my God. Yeah, I, I wouldn't say I really enjoyed that, but at the same time, it was kind of interesting in a way that seeing the response people had to that character and the hate and all the videos and all the controversy and just the reaction to it. I was kind of sat there like, wow, this is actually pretty mad. And I almost couldn't believe it myself. It was like interesting for me. There was this massive uproar about me just being like a, a loud dosser in my bloody house with my family. Yeah, it was, it was a, it was something. You're only doing YouTube for the money. Okay, this is actually, you know, this is a pretty intense one. Am I? only doing YouTube for money. There's been a lot said over the years that, you know, Morgz is just doing it for the money. Morgz doesn't care about this and that. The honest truth is, no. I know you may be there like, he's lying, he's lying. But seriously, I started YouTube when making money pretty much wasn't even a thing. Me and my friends started it. And I was, I was doing it for like three or four years before I even made a penny. And I remember my first paycheck was like 80 pounds. And I was like, I like almost collapsed to the floor. Like I could not believe it. I could not believe that I'd earned 80 pounds. You've had more than five girlfriends in your life. I hope not Morgan, that better be a lie. Okay, quite an interesting one guys. I've had more than five girlfriends in my life. True or false? The answer is, unless we're counting like, stuffed animals when I was about six, then no, I have not. In fact, not even close to that, to be honest. You were the one that in the side men's villa in Ibiza. Oh my gosh. Right, I have a story for you guys. I think it's story time. So you may have seen in the side men's recent side men Sunday, they spoke about an incident that happened on holiday while they were in Ibiza. A couple of people come back to our villa. So it's three guys, like a couple Morgs girls. was there as well. Couple girls, Morgs, yeah. yeah. And I'm and I'm sat with Cal on like the sun lounge at midday. Oh, wow. Our cleaner went into the pool storage room and found a human stool. Oh no. <laughs> well, it could be Morgs. It, 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 it could have been, been Morgs, bro. Morgs, yeah, it could have been. So pretty much I was in Ibiza on holiday at the same time, right? And I happened to run into them guys. So obviously I went back to this party with all of them. Everything was good. It was a great night. However, the next day I was informed that somebody had it's in the villa. Yeah, done it, done it number two in the villa. Now, I have to admit, it would be some story if I was the Donny that did the villa poo. However, it was not me. Freezy told me that he's seen a guy go into the same room and come out by himself. So, I think they may have caught the guy. So guys, I was not the one that did the human <laughs> stool on the floor. You can't grow a proper beard, so you keep the lip fluff. Guys, this is supposed to be assumptions. This one here is just a violation. That is a correct assumption. I cannot grow a beard. The best I can do is this, this mustache, if you can even call it that. It's pretty much just a few pubes on my lip. Last summer, I was really trying to grow my beard. So I just thought if I left it for months, then hopefully it would grow. However, that's not exactly what happened. What ended up happening was this absolute monstrosity. <laughs> are using Tamsin for views. That is a load of That's a load of Since I returned to YouTube, I've done 15 videos and Tamsin has been in the thumbnail of two of them. So yeah, once again, to everybody saying that, suck your mother through a straw. You're actually crap at football. Right, you know what? I am sick of this. I'm getting sick of this slander, okay? Everybody's saying I'm actually crap at football. Clearly you guys aren't believing my words. So, uh, you know what I'm just gonna do? I'm just gonna go outside right now. I'm just gonna walk outside and I'm just gonna put the ball down. And I'm just gonna hit the crossbar. First time, easy. Just come with me, I'll, I'll 
I will literally go do it right now. Right, you guys saying I'm trash at football, yeah? Watch this. Got my ball, I hit the crossbar, first time. Whoa! What's that? What's that? Say sorry right now in the comments. Say sorry right now, whoever made that assumption. Say sorry, I'm waiting for you to apologize to me. Any YouTuber out there that wants in a crossbar challenge, let's go. Next assumption, I'm out of here. Next assumption, next assumption. You're a millionaire. Hmm, okay. Morgs, you're a millionaire. Is this true, guys? Am I a millionaire? The question you've all been wanting to know. The truth is, guys, no. I'm not, I'm not a millionaire. I'm a multi-millionaire. You want to go back to cheese string hair? Right, if you don't know what the cheese string hair is that he's referring to, take a look at this. <laughs> ah, look at the top of his head. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest guys, I couldn't think of anything worse than going back to that. Like my hair is not amazing at the moment, but I think a bald head would be better than that if we're really being honest. You know what? I'll give you guys a chance. If this video can hit 100,000 likes, then I will get it back. I will get the blonde cheese string hair back. I'm so confident you guys ain't gonna do it. No chance, no way. 100,000 likes, do your best. You've never been arrested. Oh, oh my gosh. All right, okay, this question actually came up. Yep, uh, guys, I've never been arrested before. I'm afraid, fella, you have assumed that one wrong. And believe it or not, it was actually captured on film. So yeah, let me, uh, let me play the clip right now. FBI, open up! Ah! Morgs, Jill, you two are under arrest. For what? What did we do? You've been plugging your merch too much. It's a YouTube. You don't like the side men. Right, so this guy actually reckons that I don't like the side men. Well, to be honest, I mean, a apart from them accusing me of in their villa, I'm cool with the side men. They're, they're flipping legends of the YouTube scene. Nothing but respect for those guys. They are killing it at the moment. I don't know why you guys think I have like beef with loads of YouTubers and don't like certain YouTubers. I don't think I've actually ever been in any YouTube beef. I'm not the type of guy to start drama. Maybe I should though, you know, the views are low, seems to work. You are never doing merch again. Right guys, this is actually a little bit of a serious one. Now, you may have noticed that my merch store, morgs.co, is actually gone. It's been gone now for like almost a year. To be honest guys, the reason why was mainly just because with the whole COVID pandemic happening over the past few years, I know that for a lot of people, money has been really short. It just felt a little bit wrong for me to to be kind of like screaming about new merch coming out, new merch, buy my merch, buy my merch, while, you know, it's kind of tough times for everybody. I am actually working on relaunching my merch store with brand new merch, more tailored to the new kind of style of my content, if that makes sense. It's gonna be more grown up merch that kind of anybody can wear, more fashionable and there's gonna be a lot more work put into it compared to the old merch, which was just a little bit more rushed, if that makes sense. I'm really excited for you to see these new merch designs that I'm working on at the moment. They are literally gonna be fire. You're a sweaty kid who makes videos on random things because you're running out of content. Yeah, pretty much. Is your body count more than four? Oh. Hands in, seriously. This one's literally just like a lose-lose. If it's yes, people are gonna take the piss. If it's no, people are gonna take the piss. I don't even know how to answer this. Right, you know what? Guys, I said at the start of the video, if I refuse to answer any of them, I give away 100 pounds. I'm sorry, I'm, refu I'm refusing, I'm refusing to answer. No way, I'm gonna be giving away 100 pounds to one of you guys. Right here, 100 pounds. No. To be honest, guys, this is actually a, a fake $100 bill. It's literally just a piece of paper. But yeah, that's it. The first £100 given away to one of you guys. Watch till the end and I'll reveal how you can win it. Now, time for the final one. The big one. You got me pregnant. Ooh. 
Well, I mean, this is the question that you've all been waiting for. You guys want the answer. Tamsin is prego. I think for this one, we need to have a serious talk with you. Me and Tamsin. This one's serious. I know I'm not, I'm not usually serious, but yeah. This one is actually serious. Well, guys, um, I thought I'd bring uh, the beautiful Tams in here to answer this final question, the big one. Obviously, Tams, the people want to know if you're actually pregnant or not. So, um, what should we tell them? Yeah, do, do you want to say? Well, I don't know. Do you want to say? No, do you want to say? Guys, as you know, me and Tams have been together now for almost two years, and uh, and we thought it was time to, uh, to to take the relationship to the next step. And uh, we have some really important news to share with you guys. Guys, take take a look at this. Woo! <laughs> Tamsin's pregnant. Look at that, guys. I'm having a we're having a baby. We're having, having a baby. baby. Our due date is in a couple of weeks time. How exciting, guys. This is a truly amazing moment for the, for the Morgs channel. And oh! What is it? Oh! oh! What is it, Tamsin? Oh! We're all gonna think I'm having a baby. Oh my God, oh! Tam! Guys, I may be ditching the, the fake Morgs character, but I've still got my amazing acting. Guys, before you leave the video, if you want to win the £100, all you have to do is subscribe to my channel, drop a like on the video, and then comment down below why you want the £100. And I'll pick one of you, and message you, and send you the money. Adios!